Hello. It is time for prayer again, once again in Release and Renew, our Lenten practice. So today we have a great one. I release any need to complain. And complaint is one of those insidious things that it feels good in the mo moment to release the frustration within. But the problem is complaining can become chronic. It can become an affirmation. It can become a default position. It becomes a rut that we fall into all the time, complaining, complaining, complaining. And if you're anything like me, you know that um, our friends who complain constantly are not a lot of fun to be around. And so the complaints actually push things, opportunities, and people away from you. We all want to be with people who are more upbeat and positive without denying the reality of certain situations. We can see the situation clearly and look past it or through it to what's possible on the other side. So today I invite us to breathe into this moment and pray together as we release complaint. As we breathe into this moment, we let go of the need to constantly and reflexively complain. We let go of the understanding that something in this world, something in our lives is worthy of derision and our attitudes of hostility towards it. For that energy of hostility and anger and frustration does not release what we don't want, but actually brings us more of it. Understanding the law of attraction, we take this moment to release our need to complain and instead use that energy to create what we want. So when something is not aligned with our highest ideals, when something shows up that we find inconvenient and disruptive to our plans, we look at it and say, how can I find the good in this? How can I shift this situation and release our need to complain about it and ask, how can we use it for our highest good or for the good of a larger community? Today, we release any need to complain about anything in God's world for everything is an expression of divine energy. So we use it to achieve new heights. Today, we say thank you for this opportunity. Thank you for the possibilities in this day. Thank you, God. I have no complaints. And so it is. Amen. Namaste. Credit where credit is due. Reverend Carlos Thomas used to teach us that at Unity of New York. Thank you, God. I have no complaints whatsoever. That mantra, that understanding, shifts you for the situation at hand. Thank you, Carlos. <laughs>